Oh yeah, we yeah. getting it in, man. New Year's, New Year's Day, first day yeah. of the year, you know. We out here getting it. Y'all sleeping? Y'all, yeah. Now trip. If you want, if you want to go get it, you gotta go get it yourself. Yeah. You know what I mean? Let's go, let's go. It's hard work. It's hard work. I'm yeah. getting tired. <laughs> We'll be working. Yeah. Uh, Reese Hack, Salem, Oregon. Uh, possible in the Willamette University or St. Mary's out in Kansas. Uh, we're out here grinding, man. Way to start the year off great, and uh, can't think of a better place to do it or a better group to do it with. Yeah. Stomach tight. Come on, come on, come on. Hallward pays off. We're here getting it. Working on the one best from dudes like me, my size. So what that means to get more events in, you gotta have more bids come. The thing is, you gotta, you gotta figure out what your fears are, and not be afraid to list them out and put them down on paper so you can get over them and then move past them and figure out which bad habits are causing you to have fear. So then you can get over the fear itself, and then from there. You gotta figure out a way to replace those bad habits with some good habits. That's the only way, you know, that's one of the first steps that we're gonna have to use to find your focus. And then once you can find your focus, now let's find your purpose. What are, what's your purpose for going to school? What's your purpose for playing at the next level? That's the only way you're gonna be successful at what you're trying to do is you have to have a purpose. If you don't have a purpose, you're just gonna be another team player in the program that might happen to play five years later after you done wasted 48 or 60 months out of school and probably not graduate. So you gotta figure out what your purpose is for your academics and your focus. And that's that.